Hello everyone, Cryodog here. I'm going to do an unboxing of the Panasonic HC V100M. Uh, this has 16 gigabytes of uh, onboard storage. So let's get started. Okay, so first we have the charging adapter. We have the manual and other materials. camera itself connector to a uh, for a TV for the camera battery, the power cord for the charging adapter, and then we have the USB cable uh, for plugging into the computer, and then we have some software. Let's take a look at the camera now. Oops. Put these items back in the box. And we'll set this to the side. Okay, so first impressions, it's very small. Um, fits pretty comfortably in the hand. Does have a fold out viewer which you can turn around so if you're recording yourself you can see actually what's happening. On the fold out viewer it has navigation buttons for the on screen menus. It has a enter button and a menu button. On the side we have the power button, uh, HDMI connector, <coughs> and multi-AV connector, a delete button, and then a button for manual operation. I'm guessing this is to change uh, certain manual settings. It has Dolby sound, and then it has a the speaker, and then the USB connection. On the back, <coughs> have the battery slot. You have a battery hinge, and the record button. You have the record and then playback mode selector. Your zoom in and out switch. Your still camera button to take still shots. <coughs> then on the side, you have the charging port. On the front you have the shutter switch. So this is 42x zoom, 
HD with onboard 16 gigs of storage 32.5 wide view guessing that's what that is um, so that's pretty much it <coughs> So let's put a battery in and see if it powers up. So what we want to do is we want to turn the the wire part facing the the wire part on the inside. That's it. You just pull the little lever here down. And then you can slide the battery out. And then you push it in at the top and then push on the bottom to put it back in place. So let's power it on. Wow, that was quick. On the bottom has the tripod mounting bracket. It also has a slot for external memory card. I believe it's an SD card or SDXC. I think that's what it's called. Um, so you can add more, more storage uh, space to it. <clears throat> all in all I would say this is a pretty good uh, camera uh, price is about $250 I ordered this uh, from newegg.com and um, I'll play around with it see how I like it and um, hopefully you'll be seeing some more videos from this coming soon thanks for watching